Hey guys, I'm back with another video, except today is a little bit different. It's not a makeup tutorial or anything like that. I had some time, so I thought I would film a makeup room tour slash makeup collection because I get asked this like all the time. You guys want to see it, so I had some time and I'm going to do that for you. So if you want to see my makeup room tour slash collection, please keep on watching. So when you walk in, this is what you see. That's me. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to start off over here. This is where I film my videos and my TikToks and I take pictures here. And I kind of just, I used to get ready over there, hence this bench, it used to be over there. But I moved it over here for filming because, I don't know, I just thought the light was better this way. And over here, it would be like behind my head, so it wouldn't really work. So yeah, I kind of moved everything over here. And this is where I get ready now. I kind of miss it over there because obviously it's like such a nice big vanity and there's a lot more space. But I'm thinking of getting a bigger table. This is literally like a jewelry box stacked on top of a table with my mirror on it. So yeah, I'm definitely going to update this. So throughout this video, just so you guys know, there's like a few things that I want to change and add. So yeah, maybe once that is all done, I could make an updated video. But for now, since you guys ask all the time, I wanted to film one anyways. So yeah, over here is where I get ready and film. So these are my brushes that desperately need cleaning, but that's where I keep my brushes. I have like my go-to stuff over here. I have more in the drawers, which I will get to and show you guys after. But yeah, this is like my go-to stuff that I use pretty much every day. I have some lip glosses, a BB cream, small brushes, um, foundation, concealer, stuff like that powders, my go-to lipsticks, Charlotte Tilbury, KKW, lip liners, mascaras, liners, stuff like that, my favorite powders, and yeah. So over here is my tripod, which usually is here for when I'm filming, and just like a little hand mirror because I'm blind. I can't like see from here, so if I need to pull in closer, I'll use that. But in here, I have like a little tiny makeup bag full of stuff that doesn't fit on the tiny little, I guess, table if you want to call it. But yeah, I have like my Fenty glosses, another BB cream, which I actually love, by the way. I've never tried them until recently. Maybelline sent them to me and I actually really like them. So I keep one there. And I have a couple bronzers, a blush, some blotting powder, the eyelashes that I usually wear every day my Kylie palette that I've been reaching for, and I think this is my Makeup by Mario little crystal reflector. So that's what's in there. I just kind of keep that on the side, and I use these as well pretty much every day. I use the Carly Bible palette. This is my Mario Master Mattes and my Mario lip palette. So I like to just um, keep everything that I use every day like right in front of me so I don't need to go like into my drawers. But yeah, that's this little section over here. So I'm going to keep my like main makeup drawers for last because that's like the best part, obviously. But over here is where I do people's makeup. It used to be over here. If you've gotten your makeup done by me, you know I usually have the chair like set up right there. But since I haven't done anyone lately because of the pandemic and I moved everything over here for my filming and stuff, I moved my chair over here, which I actually kind of like better. So I think that's kind of cute. And at the bottom over there, like, oh my God, where's my finger? Like right there, I have my little makeup kit and it kind of like fits in with the decor, if you want to say. And I just pull it out when I do people's makeup and I just have like some bags and some boxes for decoration. Over here, I have these like really old little pictures and a rosary. I got this in Rome, it's so pretty. But yeah, I have these pictures and I need to update them. They're so old and I'm just sick of them. I need to update them. I really, really want to get like a neon sign. I think that's so cute. But yeah, that is that corner. So over here along this wall, I have like my big mirror. I'll go into that area after, but for now, this is like my couch. Nothing special, just my couch. 
but I really do love this couch. It's from Winners, I believe, or like Home Sense, same thing, but yeah, it's really pretty. I found it there a few years ago. So that's my pretty couch, my window. Yeah, okay, so this is my beautiful big mirror. Also found it, oh no, this one actually was from Marshall, it's not Winners. But yeah, this is my really, really nice big mirror that I love so much. It's so nice, so you can see like your full outfit. My closet's right there, so it's perfect. And okay, this is the, the messy part. So this is all like recent PR packages that I've received that I don't really know like where to put yet. I've taken like most of the makeup out, but I still really like these boxes and I don't want to throw them out. So I need to come up with like some sort of storage for these. So for now they're tucked away in this little corner, but yeah, that's what's over here. I like this little corner because it just has all these little pretty boxes, but it's kind of like, I guess it's a pretty mess. <laughs> okay, so this is the fun part. This is like the main part of the room, I guess you could say. I have my vanity and some decorations over here. So I think, okay, let's start off over here actually. So I have this really nice, tall, typical, I feel like everyone has this Ikea shelf. And at the bottom I have some like bags and that's just like random makeup bags and stuff right there. But yeah, I have like my Louis Vuitton bags that inside of them I keep like old and yeah, some old, some current fragrances like body mists and creams. I have some candles in there. It's a nice huge bag, so it kind of hides stuff. Um, but yeah, most of this shelf is actually like packaging from products and bags and stuff like that. So I feel like that's like a really nice way that you can decorate your room or your space is by using like packaging and bags and like shoes and stuff like that i i mean that's how like i've done it pretty much and i don't know i think it looks pretty nice it kind of just it's like an easy way to decorate i mean you you're buying stuff anyways so use it to its fullest capacity why not so up here on this little shelf well up there is just bags gucci bag mac and this random like Dollarama and sparkly gold bag. But here I have this little new one, it's from Walmart, it's so cute. I used to have it in my room, but I added it in here, cause why not? I have some Chanel boxes, this little ColourPop, Sailor, Pop, Sailor Moon one, a Gucci one, YSL, and some Too Faced back there if you can see it. So that's what that is. Next, I have my little Kylie shelf with some shoes and I really like this shelf because it has like all my lip kits that I've kept. Um, yeah, I keep the nicest ones here in the front. They're so pretty. I just feel like they're so nice like for a makeup room, for decoration. You have your own like little lip kit wall. It's so cute. So I've kept those. And then the next one I have, this is like one of my favorite pair of shoes. I wore this for my 19th birthday, first time at the club, my sparkly pretty shoes. So I have those there because they're just so nice. And behind I have just a plain little Chanel bag. And then down here, let me crouch, I have my purse that I use all the time. It's so pretty, so I keep it there when I'm not using it. But behind it, I have this little Celine box. I got it with my glasses and it's just so cute. It matches like the white Prada bag and that's just like in the background of my purse which I got in Monte Carlo Louis Vuitton. It's my little baby. I love it so much. And then down here is like my little Audrey Hepburn. I, I wasn't like going with this plan but it kind of so happened to look very like Audrey Hepburn inspired. These shoes kind of remind me of her and the little Tiffany's, like Breakfast at Tiffany's, and of course the Audrey Hepburn in the movies book. I also have her a really big, it's like huge, really big picture of her right there. But yeah, that's pretty much this whole corner. Let me put my mirror back. 
But yeah, that's the whole corner. Okay, so over here on my vanity, I pretty much keep everything that I really, really like the packaging of and I wanna keep it on display. So I have everything right there. So starting off over here, I have these little Kylie lip sets. I really like the packaging of these. So I kept them right on that little corner. And then just over here, I have a journal and my um, calendar and a couple of pens. And over here is my super cute little Christmas tree. I have my Christmas decorations out right now, my tree and my little cute nutcracker guy over there. And these are just um, my two favorite fragrances at the moment that I reach for. So I keep them right there. This is the Ariana Grande Rem. So, so good. And it looks beautiful on a vanity. So I have that right there. And my Bath and Body Works winter scent, the snowflakes and cashmere. So yeah, I have those right by the little cute Christmas tree. And then over here on my little center piece, if you want to call it centerpiece, like little tray, I got it at Winners and it's so cute. I got like most of my stuff at Winners, to be honest with you. A lot of stuff in here is from Winners. And over here, let's start on this side. So I have this KKW Beauty X Kylie Cosmetics box. I just love it. I loved that collection. So I really like the packaging and I wanted to keep it on my vanity. And then I just have some Kylie Cosmetics blushes and highlighters right there. And my Carly Bible X Il Maquillage lipsticks I have on display as well. And then over here is all like my pretty lipsticks and pretty products. I have some Charlotte Tilbury. I have this I have this cute little Juicy Couture Glossier. I think these are Milani. Yep. And then I have some Chanel foundation that's like really old. I just kept them for aesthetic reasons. And I have some Jeffree Star, um, Dior, this Gucci lipstick my boyfriend got for me for my birthday, and which was in June. I have not yet touched it. I like can't bring myself to using it because it's so beautiful. Does anybody else do that? Like you just have like the prettiest lipsticks or like anything that you just don't want to ruin. And over here is some Chanel lipsticks. These are my favorite Chanel lipsticks. And I have some YSL. I have some little old Kylie loose, I think they're like pigments or like highlighters, I think. And more YSL and some more Ariana Grande perfume. So that's that right there. I have this Chanel highlighter, Chanel bronzer, my Kai brow box. It has like more makeup on there. I just like to keep the box there because I just think it looks so cute, like the eyes and the eyebrows. Looks pretty on the vanity. Next here, I just have my Rare Beauty little mini collection. I also really like the packaging of this brand, so I keep it on my vanity. And then here I have all my Kylie, well I have more in the drawer, but these are like the main high glosses that I have. And there's some of my favorites, so I keep them on my counter. They're all there, one's back there. And then behind them, I have the Mariah Carey X Mac. It's kind of like an older collection, but yeah, their packaging is just so beautiful. And I just like the sparkly glitter silver vibe. Just matches my room. And then right here, I just have my little Louis Vuitton bracelet box because I like to keep it in its box. And right here in this cute corner, I have my little um, nutcracker guy and all my perfume. So I have some Chanel, Mademoiselle, so good. YSL Black Opium, one of my favorites. And that is Victoria's Secret, more YSL and more Ariana Grande. That one's one of my favorites, the Ari perfume. So good. So yeah, that's pretty much everything on my vanity. Okay, so moving on now to these little front drawers here. This one is a total collection of 
randomness. It's just like leftover stuff that I have no idea where to put it. So I threw it in there, but yeah. You'll see throughout the next portion of this video, I'm like so low on storage. I've like reached like max capacity. I need more drawers and I need more space for stuff. So this drawer is just like full of randomness. So I'm gonna skip that drawer. I'm not gonna go into depth of what's inside there cause it's like not cute at all. So moving on, I'm gonna show you my other drawer. This one's the nice one, this one's pretty. So in here, is all my eyeshadow palettes so I have it organized mostly like according to brand over here I have it kind of goes in deeper there um I have all my like Kylie palettes so I have the stormy palette the Valentine's Day palette this one was so pretty oops now I'm gonna mess up everything but this one was so nice kind of messy but so pretty oh and there's the little holiday i think this was like three years ago the chill baby palette her packaging is just always the cutest i have the bronze palette the kylie x Mon. this one was also one of my favorites so pretty oh my god one of the favorites one of the best by far the sailor palette that's like one of the most current ones this was the peach one i think I think this one was also really nice. Let's open it since we're opening everything anyways. This is the... One second. Oh my god, this is so hard to do with my hand. Ugh. Yeah, that's the peach. Royal peach is what it's called. I use this color a lot, as you can tell. But this one's really nice. Another one of my favorites. So these here are the Makeup by Mario Glam Quads. They're so pretty. I have a picture of them up on Instagram if you want to see them. I'm not going to like go through every palette and open them because it would literally take me forever. But yeah, those are the Mario ones. I have this MAC Classic Cutie Dominique Cosmetics Latte 2. So pretty. This Sailor Moon ColourPop one. I haven't even used this yet, but I had to have this collection because I loved Sailor Moon as a child, like literally was obsessed with Sailor Moon. So when I saw they came out with the um, collection with ColourPop, I had to have it. I had to have it. But yeah, no, I haven't used it yet, sadly, but I will. Then I have more ColourPop over here that one of my best friends, Tanessa, got for me for my birthday this year. I have the Glowing Coconuts, the Mint, which I love the Mint. And it's my pleasure. It's like all pinks and purples and stuff like that. Okay, here I have, I thought I, oh yes, I did have more MAC. This is the MAC and Selena um, collection palette that I actually posted this on Instagram too. So if you guys want to check out a picture, I have it on Instagram. Um, over here in this corner, I have all my Morphe palettes. I have some more palettes in this random drawer, but they're kind of old. So these are all like my more recent and newer ones. I have Madison Beer. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm literally like out of breath. I don't talk this much on a daily basis. But anyways, yes, I have my Morphe palettes here. I have Madison Beer. I have this Neutral palette, Jeffree Star. And I think under there are just some of their like classic, you know, those like huge palettes. Then right here, I have some KKW Beauty and some face palettes. I have the KKW, I could probably open this one, yeah. Highlighter palette, oh, why don't I use this anymore? So beautiful. I have that. I have some Anastasia Glow Kits. I have, I think this is called the Sugar one or something like that. That one's really pretty. This one I bought in high school. It's kind of old, but they did bring it back, which is nice. I should have bought a new one, but this one was one of my favorites. Let's open it. Let's see this one. Yeah, so pretty. I haven't looked at this in a while. I really liked this shade, but this is the Nicole Guerrero Anastasia Glow Kit. So I keep those all there. And then actually... Under here, I have some KKW Beauty. I have matte, the classic two, and the little, so dirty. I use it all the time, but um, that's the Mrs. West collection. 
so yeah those are all my palettes for the most part all in here they all fit perfectly so again low on storage space but yeah that's the drawer okay so this is the star of the show the main part of my makeup collection so let's start off with what i have on top so over here i just have a lottery bag i'm not even going to show you what's inside it's just like complete randomness like i have like a lighter for my candles and like stuff like that that i would need throughout my room that i don't want to show and have on display because it's ugly but yeah i keep like randomness in there i of course have a little hand sanitizer these are from bath and body works they're so cute because they're like a little spray so i like that i have that right for when i enter my room and then again i just have another little bag for decor i have some sunglasses i where did I oh yeah Ardeen I think I got these at Ardeen for like super cheap and these are my Dior reflected sunglasses I think they're called but they're really pretty and over here I have a picture of me and my boyfriend kind of old have to update it but yeah and then if you know me you know I have like a weird obsession with crystals these are just like three of like my nicest ones that I keep in my makeup room they're not only like pretty but they have good energy and stuff like that. So I like to keep those in my room. I have more in my bedroom, but these are like my main ones that I really, really like. Okay, let's start with the drawers. All right, so the top drawer is all Kylie Cosmetics. I have all her like collections that they've come out with lately. Some of this stuff I bought myself and a lot of this stuff um, was sent to me which I'm so grateful for I love her products so let's start up here I have the most recent collections I have the sailor collection the leopard collection and these actually were from these little kits and I just have them over here because I keep most of my um, high glosses over there with too soft but I have these super cute little baby minis. Like they're the cutest things ever. Look at them compared. I don't even know if she has these on the side anymore, but of course have those. And those are from the winter collection. These I think were a birthday collection. And these are all lip liners. I have all the like special collection ones at the top. And then all underneath I have the regular ones. Okay, so over here, I have, let's start with the top row. These are just, I think, bare that I wear like all the time. So I have these. And then I have all the lip blushes. And I think, oh yeah, these were also a part of these little lip sets. So underneath I have all the regular lip kits. Liquid lips. Underneath there. So it's like a two layer of all the Kylie Cosmetics lip little vials and then on this side here i have well these are just like normal plain lipsticks of hers and then this was the kkw beauty collab don't mind my nails by the way they're so disgusting i haven't gotten them done since march but yes please ignore them um these are mainly all like collections that they've come out with like the special type of collections like as opposed to the regular lip kits so I have the Sailor one, the Cheetah or whatever, Leopard, Coco, Balmain, I think that was these two, I think, the pink and the green were birthday, and then that's a little stormy one. So cute. So yeah, that's my Kylie drawer. All right, so my next drawer is some more lip stuff. And I have, starting on this side, I have some Makeup by Mario, his newest lip glosses for the holiday collection. They're so beautiful. I love them. And then down here, I have a Carly Bible X Il Maquillage. I have some Morphe, more MAC X Selena, and my Lancome Juicy Tubes, which are iconic. So good. And then back here, these out of the way. I have all my favorite MAC tubes. They're just so cute in this little compartment. 
and in the back I have just some regular normal ones and in the front I have special like collabs and collections so let's start off over here I think this one's just a regular one actually it just didn't fit in the top row um, this one is a Viva Glam it's the Ariana Grande one let me show you guys so it's this one here always been a huge Ariana Grande fan. Is it focusing? Always been a huge Ariana Grande fan. If you know me, I love her. So I'm really happy I was able to get this like way back then when it came out. I think like, I don't even know, four years ago, something like that. Maybe less, maybe more. I don't know. But around that, I don't think she was as big as she is now. So it's pretty cool to have that in my collection. And these here are Mac and Selena. I love them. I love the packaging. This is just a regular Mac Velvet Teddy. It just has like different packaging. So I threw that in the front row. This is a Mariah Carey and Mac. The packaging of these were gorgeous. This one was so pretty. It has like the butterfly. Barely even used these. I didn't even want to ruin them. So of course I barely used that. Okay, and then this one I have uh, Mac X Aladdin, which was so pretty. It's just a pretty nude. I just really love the packaging. It's so nice. And I'm a huge Disney fan too, so I had to have that. And this last one here, I'm not too sure what um, collab it is, to be honest with you, but I just really like the packaging. It's so cute, and it's like a coral color, so it's really pretty. And then right here in this little front um, compartment, I have all my KKW Beauty lip products. I have some more actually, like over here, just like extra in a bag. Usually I take these like when I do clients, so I have those in there. But all like my personal ones are of course separated and in here. So these were a part of a, I think these were collection and these were collection as well. But underneath I have all the regular ones. Nudes. And these are all the corresponding glosses, which I love. These glosses are amazing. They're so pigmented. They're so creamy and so beautiful. These here were a part of the wedding collection, I believe, for Mrs. Best collection. And this was a collab with Mario. And then over here, I just have some more lip liners and like lipstick type of things. This is KKW Beauty. I have some MAC in there, Il Maquillage and a little lip sharpener from Mario. And then over here, I actually have a spare Mario palette that they sent me. Um, I have two, so it's nice. I have an extra one that I could throw in my kit afterwards. So yeah, that's that little drawer. Okay, so this drawer is a little funny. I have a funny story. I actually ordered um, this back here recently on Amazon and I thought it was going to be like big enough for compacts when it doesn't even fit a lipstick so I have like all my compacts like basically kind of just randomly thrown around in this drawer and then over here I have some like um sticks cream sticks I have a Jouer one which I haven't tried I just got this in the mail yesterday I got some Jouer stuff sent to me and then all here are um, Kylie Cosmetics sticks. I have a couple KKW Beauty blushes and then some more Kylie blushes back there. But yeah, this whole drawer is mainly like face stuff, face powders, and yeah, kind of messy. I need to get like an actual container that fits compacts and not a little tiny mini one for lipsticks. Made that mistake. But yeah, that's all that is. Okay, so next I have this drawer and it's all like eyeliners, eye glitters, mascaras, some brow stuff, little eye stones and just stuff like that. I have back here, I have some liquid eyeshadows from Dominique Cosmetics. I have some brow pencils, some random eyeliners, a bunch of glitter eyeliners. They're so pretty. And over here I have just some extra mascara from Maybelline and an extra brow pencil. I go through those like crazy. The Benefit Precisely My Brow is my favorite. And I have little extra mini professional primers from Benefit, a bunch of Benefit brow products right there, 
these are the Kylie Shadow Sticks. They're so nice. So I keep those right there. And yeah, those little rhinestones. I got those at Michael's. They're so pretty on the eyes. I'm sure you guys have seen on my Instagram. I've done a few looks with them. And then over here, I have a little spare of the Benefit Gimme Brows. I love, love, love this product. And here I have a bunch of Makeup by Mario sharpeners that came with all of his eyeliners. I have his pencil liners and I have a liquid liner. Then right here is all my Benefit uh, mascaras. They're all just extra. I haven't opened them yet. So I just have a good stockpile of mascara. I will never run out. So that's great. That is that drawer. Okay, so the next drawer is just all lashes i have all my lily lashes right here at the front because i wear these the most when i do like instagram posts or tiktoks i'm usually wearing these and back there i just have some spares of ardell kiss and like some random brands back there some individuals these here were a part of the cheetah i keep seeing cheetah i think it's leopard leopard collection from kylie cosmetics and this was the pair of lashes that were a part of the Sailor Collection. The packaging is so beautiful. Of course, Kylie always has like the best packaging. Oops. But yeah, that's this drawer. All lashes. Okay, for the last drawer is more lip stuff. This is mainly just like miscellaneous brands and more MAC, more randomness. But yeah, back there I have some Lime Crime. I have more MAC. And back there, right in there, if you could see, I have more of the Ariana Grande Viva Glam. Again, I'm so happy I got those in my collection. Um, and these beautiful Mariah Carey ones. Oh my god, these are so funny. I found these at Winners. They're Paris Hilton. Oh my god, I have to have them. I love her. So yeah, I have those. And I have some Dominique Cosmetics. I have some of the ColourPop lippy sticks back there on the side. And then over here, I have some Pat McGrath. These are just Victoria's Secret. They're so cute. And these Maybelline Lifter Glosses. I have some Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks and Dominique Cosmetics lipsticks or lip glosses, actually. And then over here, again, just some more random brands. These are ColourPop. I have a Kylie one in there. I have Kiko. I have... NYX lingerie and this really pretty Patrick Ta gloss which I love and yeah like I said I got a really beautiful package in the mail from Jouer Cosmetics and they actually sent me all of their best of nudes I think it was called and they're all just cute little mini liquid lipsticks and glosses so I kept that right in there because I have to try those but yeah, that's pretty much everything. These bottom drawers, I just have like packaging. This is like a weird like thing that I do. I don't know why I do this. Let me know if you do this. You'll make me feel a lot better about myself. But I keep like all the packaging to really pretty makeup that I like. Just because, I don't know, I, I like I feel bad throwing it out. It's so, so pretty. So it definitely takes up a lot of space in my drawers. So I want to find like a different way to store this because I kind of need these drawers. But yeah, that's pretty much everything in my drawers. Okay guys, so that's pretty much everything. I'm so happy I was finally able to film this video for you guys because I know a lot of you have been wanting to see it. So yeah, I'm super happy I'm able to put this up for you guys. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel. Until then, I'll see you guys next time.